Alright, hey guys, what I'm going to be doing this evening is playing Jurassic Park Operation Genesis uh, from 2003. This is one of my favourite uh, Jurassic Park games uh, that they ever made. Uh, but what I'm going to be doing tonight is actually trying to build Jurassic World as best I can uh, in this system. So, let's see. Let's see what it says. Now it says here... I have right so who have we got in the chat at the moment it says we've got five people and can you guys hear me all right all right I'm just playing the opening while uh, we sort this out so I just need to know can you guys hear me and uh, who's watching at the moment we've got a few people in the chat already Yeah, cool. All right, you guys can hear me. So, let's just get the game going. So, I haven't got a save file on this or anything. I only got a PlayStation 2 memory card today. Um, I had to go out and buy one because I actually thought I had one left in my uh, in my drawers. But so, what I'm going to do is actually. Uh, Try and create new blower as best I can. Uh, let's see, generate new. It's very hard to get like um, the right shape of the islands that they had in the films, but it can somewhat be done. See, I kind of like this one because it's got that little. You can see it spinning around the bottom. It's got this tiny little uh, island. Which is, yeah, almost like Jurassic Park, uh, with the the little island that they fly past um, at the opening. Cool. Everyone's saying Master Builder says he can hear me loud and clear, so that's good. All right. So, uh, I'll keep the mountains as it is because I like to have the uh, like a valley in the mountains, so I can. Uh, uh, build in the middle of it, but if we're going to do it like Jurassic World, we need like a mountain, one mountain at the top of the island, uh, Mount Cebu. Um, I can always flatten the island, so maybe I'll do it like that. I'll do it like that, so yeah, okay. No, wait. Let's try... I'll do it like this and then, yeah, we'll, we'll work from it there. Alright, let's build this island. So I hope everyone's alright. Um, Colosorian Productions asked, do you think they should make a sequel to this? Yes, of course. They should so make a sequel to this and update it with, like, you know, the Indominus Rex and... Uh, you can have like a raptor uh, sort of squad in there and uh, ride motorbikes and make it more like... Imagine Operation Genesis 2 being more like a Grand Theft Auto type game but set on Jurassic Park so you can sort of like do whatever you want. You can walk around the park if you want or you can come out of walking around and manage the park from like a uh, overhead view like in this game. That'd be pretty fun. Alright. Hopefully the PlayStation uh, <laughs> works well. So this is obviously my first live stream. I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, I'm definitely making these live streams a uh, a more regular thing um, because why not? Plus we can get some stuff out of the way easier. So like, you know, talk about Jurassic Park and stuff. All right, uh, welcome to your new park. Yep, we all know that. All right, so. This was a problem with the PlayStation 2 version, the one I'm playing with, is they always assign you a, uh, a dig site automatically. It's not like you can pick whatever first one, uh, pick whatever one you want. So they've given me um, this one. So I guess I'm just going to put a team there. Yeah, all right.
Wow. Two months to make a Jurassic World in Minecraft. You know, I've never played Minecraft. Never never even touched it. Never even been near it. Um, I don't know why. Never been, never been, I don't know. I've never been, like, sort of drawn to it. Um, okay, so research teams. Now, something that they need to research quickly are these vaccinations. Actually, wait, there's a dinosaur one. Speeds up DNA extraction and automatic immune newborn dinosaurs with available vaccines when they are born. That will be handy to do first. Okay, so let's get a sense of where we are on the island. So I'm going to pretend that this is Nublar. <laughs> this is going to be the north of the island. This is going to be the, the south. So I'm going to build the park around here. Okay. So actually, to begin with, I will start with the lake, the the Mosasaur Lagoon. Can you look after this while you're recording? Right now, now we have to imagine like we're coming at it from this angle. So, um, let's build. Need an entrance, so let's say let's say this entrance. I know it's not 100% <laughs> correct, but let's imagine this entrance is the innovation centre. So we're going to build Main Street coming up this way. Actually, I need to flatten this land. So now we've got, <laughs> maybe I'll make it a little bit bigger, but we've got the the equivalent of the Mosasaur Lagoon right here. And then, okay, and then I'll build the entrance here. So it'll be almost like the uh, Innovation Center. Now I've got to line this up correctly because this is a, uh, Okay, I'm going to put it about here. All right. <laughs> so this will be the Mosasaur Lagoon and this will be Main Street. And then we have the Innovation Center right there. Someone asked me, did I see Force Awakens? I did. Yes, I did. I saw it uh, a couple of days after it was uh, released, actually. All right. So... Uh, now I'm going to build, hey, actually, so things you need first, let's build a dinosaur pen. Now I'm actually going to build over here, um, I'm going to build the Pachycephalosaurus pen, if, if I get one, but this will be like a herbivore pen over here. be a small, a really small pen actually, maybe I should make that bigger. Um, Dr. Grant's messaging me. L. Dr. Grano. Yeah, sick trikers in the uh, in the in the chat now. Welcome to the uh, building of Jurassic World. I'm trying to build Jurassic World in Jurassic Park Operation Genesis. So we've got the Mosasaur Lagoon. This will be Main Street. There's the Innovation Center. Um, the helipad is behind the Innovation Center, um, and this will be the Pachycephalosaurus Arena when it's up and building or up and running. That there for when we've got dinosaurs, right? Oh, look at that! I've got a Pachycephalosaurus. Excellent. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even know. We've got the 
booklet here. I've got the the box right here. And we'll see. See what dinosaurs we're meant to get. I think we get with the Pachycephalosaurus. Um, let me just excuse for a second, guys. I'm just going to see if I can find what uh, dinosaurs I get with it. Because on the PC version, you actually got more choices of dinosaurs um, in terms of how many dig sites you could get. Oh, nice. So I've either got I've got Pachycephalosaurus, and I can get Albertosaurus and Ankylosaurus. Now, if I'm building Jurassic World, I definitely need Ankylosaurus. Um, looks like we can also open the T-Rex if I get enough dollar. Um, but the T-Rex comes with Corinthiosaurus and Styracosaurus. And then I get one more, which would I need Velociraptor, Gallimimus. I wouldn't have many... Damn, I need like a... Uh, a a long-necked dinosaur, don't I? I need like a, a Patasaurus or something of the equivalent. But anyway, right. Let's start un unearthing this Pachycephalosaurus remains. There we go. Um, right, what was it? I've got another message. Yeah, I'm already doing that, Arnold. <laughs> yeah, I know the uh, Jurassic World toys suck. <laughs> I know. Although I haven't, uh, I haven't actually bought any myself because I uh, can a be bothered. Um, I'm going to hire one member of staff while while we're doing all this. There he is. He's just going to clean these paths. There he is. Look, his little pink shirt and his. <laughs> really blocky design. Look at his hat. He looks like he's wearing like a bird's head on his hat. On his head. <laughs> Alright. Now. Uh, Dr. Wu. Alright. Hell yeah. We can open up. We can start growing a Pachycephalosaurus. I'm going to put three in here. And then I'm going to build a... Viewing, viewing platform. Now, don't worry. I will. I will start to make it look a little bit more like Jurassic World when, uh, when the time's right. Um, what should I build? Oh, my first dinosaur. Where is she? There it is. There it is. Life in present. For the best of every little creature on this island. <laughs> there it is. It's five days old. And it will live for a year. Less than a hamster. Uh, right, let's build uh, some food. Now I'm going to pretend that this is kind of, actually wait, because you get a, you get a toy store and a, I guess yeah this will have to be Margaritaville right on the corner here, so this is the equivalent of Margaritaville so I'm going to put a Rex burger and a Frill and Chili. Alright, so that is the equivalent of Margaritaville on the corner there. Oh, the PC graphics are better. Um, yeah. yeah, sick trike. Do you own the um, the the orange variant of the Mark Engelert poster or do you own the, um, the blue one? Because I've got the blue one right there. It's sitting right on the wall behind the camera. <laughs> Like toilets, and then I'll open up the park for the public. Now I'm going to put the toilets on the side where Owen and the kids hide, as in 
this is meant to be like where they hide from the Indominus. Oh, nice. Was it the small version or the big one? Alright, better open this up to the public. Oh, no, wait. Whoa, I nearly forgot. Security. Damn. Now, security, I'm actually going to put up on the hill here because uh, that'll be. I need to flatten the land a little bit. I hate that noise that the game makes when it's like ooh 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 when you can't when you can't build or anything. All right. Now this will be the helipad that you see the T-Rex walk on at the end of Jurassic World. That'll be the equivalent right there. All right, I got loads of messages. You found Amber. Nice. Right. Yep, I'll let visitors in when I want. Yep. Oh yeah, right, now I'm going to put them... Yeah, the big ones are just gorgeous, aren't they? The big uh, Mark Englert posters. Alright, now, Dino Belly, Dinosaur, dinosaur Flirt... No, Bumblefoot is what they usually get. Alright, now I'm going to open the park. Ladies and gentlemen, Jurassic Park. So, personally, I'm not going to lie, if they did make a sequel to Operation Genesis, which, personally, I don't think they ever they will ever do, which is unfortunate, but um, it has to be Masrani in my books. They have to uh, have Masrani in it, and he has to run the park. Because I want to play as Masrani for obvious reasons. Uh, dinosaurs. I'm trying to remember where everything is now. Let's feed these little these little bastards. All right. So we've got some Pachycephalosaurus. Might just grow one more. Oh, I don't have enough money. <gasps> No, I don't call the T-Rex Rexy. <laughs> because I think it's stupid. So, when customers start coming in, we'll, uh, we'll be rocking and rolling. How's this dinosaur doing? Just wandering. Oh, so this one's the leader. The alpha. And you can tell because there's a little tiny... Um, crown above the circle so if I move to another one you can see the crown appear that's how you know they're the leaders of the pack or the of the herd should I say <gasps> our first guests oh look we've got clones it's attack of the clones who's this Caroline from Vermont not bad I guess Nick from Michigan it seems all right. I can learn to like this place. Yes, you bloody well better. You paid like $200 to get in. There's only one set of dinosaurs at the moment. All right, now I've got some money. What, what do you guys think I should build next in my version of Jurassic World? Oh, actually, I'll be... Uh... I don't want to buy any of those yet. Ooh, nearly close to... Uh... Look at the cleaner. Doing this up. I've actually got Lego Jurassic World um, sitting up there on PlayStation 3. And um, I'm definitely going to do a live stream of that um, when once I get this wire that I'm waiting for that connects to my PC from the, oh, connects to my stream equipment. Um, and I really want to do that, <laughs> mainly for egotistical reasons, because some of my writing is actually in the LEGO Jurassic World game. Now guys, I know it's uh, exciting and all, but should I read Peter Ludlow's quarterly report 
Because do you want to read Peter Ludlow's report for me? Or shall I just delete it? I'm going to delete it. <laughs> no kid wants to read quarterly reports in a game. They just want to see dinosaurs. Alright. Let's view what's in the viewing vent so we can see this. <laughs> okay, this is what the people can see. They can see nothing. I better sort this out actually because I'm going to get guest complaints if they can't see any dinosaurs. Uh, I'm going to flatten this. Alright. Come on, people. Alright, now they should be able to see. There is an Operation Genesis mod already on PCs. See, that's better. That they can see the dinosaurs there. Or if I actually build the path. No, actually, no. They can, they can deal with that. Yeah. All right. There's a lot of patience with this game. They found nothing. 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 Tra la la. All right. Let's assign them to this one. Hello, Andrew, who's just joined the chat. We are we are good. I do believe. I'm good. I'm building Jurassic World, right now. Yeah, there's the clean alert, cleaning up the path. You do your job. All right. Um, maybe new binoculars because. Absolutely. Right. Now I don't. Ha I have hardly any money at the moment. Now. This is where you have to wait and be patient. Because you don't get money quickly in this game. I have seen. All of Walking Dead up until the end of season five, and uh, I love it. It's one of my favourite shows. I loved season five. thought it was fantastic. Um, I haven't seen season six. And my friend bought me uh, Fear of the Walking Dead, which I've got over there, which I'm not watching until I finish season six. Of, uh, well, actually, no, I could start watching it because I don't think it has any... It, it doesn't relate to the other one. Is that dinosaur dead or asleep? That's just asleep. <laughs> Look at it. it's sleeping right next to its crap. Uh I've always put his head in it. <laughs> oh yeah, I had to do a labyrinth quote for David Bowie. Bowie. I'm actually gonna hire another um cleaner because this cleaner sucks. Right, I'm gonna do something that um I don't think I should really be doing because it's cheating but as a kid I wrote this little note this notebook and it has cheats and um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put in the cheat for money do you think I should put in the cheat for money or do you guys think I should just uh, play as normal and try and beat it I'll leave it up to you. If you guys think I should use the money cheat so we can start building this properly, or should I play it properly, I'll let you decide. Um, yeah. A Pterodome is good. <laughs> it, it feels good. Uh, someone asked me, how is it? what is it like in the Pterodome? It is good. Um, this, this, uh, these live streams I'll do separately. They'll be on the Pterodome channel, but they will be sort of a separate series of videos. The movie reviews and other game reviews that I might do will be in the style of what the first episode's like. Oh, nice. Okay, Master Builder's off doing a, uh, unboxing of, uh, Jurassic Park 3, or Jurassic Park toy. Uh... 
Yeah, you can have four. Uh, you can have three dig sites on the PS2. You can have five dig sites on the PC version, which is what annoyed me about the PS2 version. Uh, Jimmy uh, Sparhawk said that. If I'm squinting like this, guys, it's because I've got the chat is actually up there. Oh, is it James? Oh, nice. <laughs> I should have guessed. Good old James Harkins. Okay, so I've got £88. Do you guys think I should put in the cheat for the money? Or should I... Because I can't do anything until more people arrive. And the helicopters take absolutely ages to arrive. So do you think I should? Alright, James is saying he, I should. Hmm. No, I only have $83. Oh, nice. Albertosaurus remains. Oh, I can sell that. Oh, nice. Oh, actually, we got a bit of money. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to build uh, the... Ankylosaurus. I'm going to build the Gyrosphere Valley. Now, that is going to be about here on the map. If I'm right. So I'm going to put this here ready to build the Gyrosphere Valley. Um, the T-Rex Kingdom will have to be in here once I get a T-Rex. I know they left without enjoying the dinosaurs. That's because I don't have enough money to buy dinosaurs at the moment. <laughs> okay, JP Operation Genesis or JPOG789 just put cheap money is good money. So, all right. You guys think I should cheat? Maybe I'll put it in once. L1 up, L1 down, L1. All right, I got some money. Peter Ludlow's just a dick in general, actually. Just, just generally. Um, Dino Belly is another one I usually get. Alright, let's build the Gyrosphere of Valley. I don't want to go too close to the... Uh, I want to build this one quite big, but... Right, this is going to be the equivalent of the Gyrosphere Valley. <laughs> and... Maybe I should put some bins on the path so the uh, cleaners are not worrying about it. Too much. Right now, I'm going to build. How much is this? 3,000 I need for that. Okay. Oh, we've gone up half a star. Excellent. All right, as soon as I get a star, I can unlock another um, uh, dig site, and then that means I can get a T Rex. What am I using? Well, you mean instead of a gyrosphere, I'm going to use a. Um, I'm going to use the tour cars as the gyrospheres because. There's no other option in this game. Um, but yeah. We're going for a heat wave at the moment. I think it helps in this game if during a heat wave you put uh, salad and then sandwiches. I think when you do that in a heat wave, people actually like it in the game. Oh, that's a good point, actually. Um, I'll, I'll leave it open, but I've got a cheat for no twisters. 
I know how irritating they can be in this game. Um, yeah. Alright, so now uh, let's do the Actually, yeah. Now the way to the Gyrosphere Valley is going to be uh, along this way. What are you telling me I can't build through this? Oh my god. I really like the music in this game. It's awesome. Yeah, I've got to be sparing. I've got to sort of make wise choices with my dig sites. And it's, it annoys me that they assign you a dig site right at the beginning. Increase the numbers of fossils coming in, you may want to purchase additional fossil hunting teams. Yeah, but I've only got £101, Dr. Grant. Uh, cheap money. Cheap money's good money. Alright. Okay. Now. Whilst... Oh my god, we need more toilets. <laughs> These people, they... Shit their pants every time they see a dinosaur, so I won't charge them yet. Yet. Okay, so Jurassic World is turning out to look pretty good so far. There's not going to be much room for the T Rex Kingdom, but I guess that's going to be uh, um, pretty representative of the actual film that it had a really small enclosure. Uh, flatten this bit ready for ready for the old T-Rex when it comes around. I can't land on it. Okay. Alright. Yeah, it's just it's just the number of dig sites that are different between this and the PC version. Like it is pretty pretty much the same. I know they're not seeing much dinosaur activity, but that will change in a minute when I unleash them on the public. All right, what have we got from the fossil market? Cretaceous herbivore. No. Yeah, I'll buy that. Why not? Alright, Ankylosaurus. Good, good, good. Right. Alright, Dr. Grant, hold your hat, hold your horses. Hmm. Alright, maybe I should build. Well, this kind of looks like. I don't know, maybe I'll put this. Okay, so we have to use our imaginations that this is the Gyrosphere Valley. Oh, 
Andrew said, I saw that Reverend movie. Yeah, I, saw, I haven't seen that. I might go see that next week. I went and saw The um, the Hateful Eight this evening. Or today, sorry, should I say. I actually really enjoyed it. I thought it was uh, very funny. Very good. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I've run this park into the ground. L1 up, L1 down, L1, bitch. L1 up, L1 down. Oh, um, there you go. Run this park into the ground. <laughs> My favourite human Jurassic Park character is um, Ian Malcolm. It's definitely Ian Malcolm. And then uh, right after Ian Malcolm is either Roland Tembo or Sarah Harding. Alright. There's a thunderstorm on the island. It's so, okay, just to clarify, if anyone's just joined us, um, I am playing Jurassic Park Operation Genesis for PlayStation 2, and uh, I'm building uh, Jurassic World as best I can. Um, and also... I'm, the only cheat I'm using is the money cheat because it takes absolutely ages to build a park properly if you uh, if you don't cheat and because I'm live streaming I don't want to be here forever so <laughs> aside from that I'm using just the money cheat just to help us build this place all right I'm actually saying that can we build an ankylosaurus now no nope. Yeah, Muldoon and his long socks. Hoiking him up to his knees. Look at this guy. This guy actually looks like he's... Kind of looks like they wanted to put Spielberg into the game, but... <laughs> they can only get a blurry picture of him to wrap this around the, the, uh, the shell of this character. <laughs> it's like, Mr. Spielberg! And they try to take a photo of him. But it was actually, yeah, it was like a picture they took of Spielberg from this distance here. But then they blew it up so when you zoom in, it's like this. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so maybe I'll birth another Pachycephalosaurus. Just um, for the viewers. And then I'll move the food dispenser. I nearly activated emergency mode then. And I'll put this right here and put some paleo bales out so then people who are viewing, and it shouldn't be £10, it should be free. They've just paid like a ridiculous amount of money to come in. Okay, uh, this viewing platform should be free as well. Yes, I do want to purchase another team. And I'll put them up here. All right. Ooh. Well, this was actually a feeding pen um, in in the movie that they fed the raptors in. Like, whether they had more on the island, I don't know. But I think they just adapted it for this game. It's like, this is what you birthed them from. But anyway. Uh, what am I building now? No, I can't build that yet. Um, can't build the... Well, actually, yeah, I can. I can start to build. I haven't got the... Um, the really, really uh, safe fences up yet, but... 
I think I can start to build the T-Rex paddock just cause I'm just gonna do this. Oh shit. Uh, no, I didn't do that. Maybe I'll, uh, maybe the gyrosphere path's just gonna have to, oh man, this is turning into shambles. Yeah, Jurassic Raptors just joined us. Yeah, I know. I haven't, um, I haven't actually researched the rest area yet. I will do that. Um, I'm just sorting out uh, my version of Jurassic World in this. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to build the T Rex kingdom at the moment. All right, let's do this. Uh, up. Oh, you can't bring this round? Why is the ground so irritating? Alright, the storm's passing now. We're into the safe zone. Right, can I build a path now? Ah, right, okay. Don't worry. All right, I won't worry about the T-Rex kingdom yet. I'll build benches for them. So I can't do anything else at the moment. Now I was a huge, huge fan of the game Roller Coaster Tycoon and Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. Um, I didn't play much of the third one, but what I did play that I loved. Um, I preferred the second one overall. I thought that was the best. And then when this, I was at the height of my. Um, Roller Coaster Tycoon madness when this game came out, and I just couldn't believe my luck that they'd released like a Roller Coaster Tycoon type game based on Jurassic Park. All right. I can't believe I can't flatten all this ground here. This madness, all this. Why can't I flatten this? I'm gonna take the path up and oh, 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 there we go. Oh, actually, no, wait. I don't want to do that because that's not what Jurassic World's like. What am I thinking? I nearly, I nearly went mad then. Alright. Now I need to put the mountain back in. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Planet Coaster, oh my word. So you just build like roller coasters on a planet. Holy crap. Um, right, what are these messages? One of the dig teams has completed this excavation and I'm going to yep. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Well, if they're dissatisfied, how about we shove an Albertosaurus up their japsy? So, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> all right. Look at these paths. What are my cleaners doing? All right. Uh, just using the money, the money cheat. That is all. I, that's the only cheat I'm going to use. Just the more money one, because if not, I'll be here for absolutely 
ages trying to do this. Right. Oh, excellent. Okay, so we can get a new dig site now. Um, right. Just uh, checking what's going on. Right, guys, I need your help. So, I obviously want a T-Rex. So that's Judith River Group B. However, with the T-Rex, you get Corinthiosaurus, which is which would be kind of cool to put in with the Ankylosaurus in the Gyrosphere Valley when that's up and running, um, and Styracosaurus, which I can also put in as sort of the equivalent of a Triceratops. Um, but then that leads us with what options we have afterwards. Do we want the one with Velociraptor and Gallimimus? But then that only that means we won't have any sauropods, or do we want to go for Site B, <laughs> uh, which has the Morrison Foundation, which has Brachiosaurus, Camarasaurus, and Dilophosaurus? Um, you kind of wish they'd just put all the dinosaurs. Go for Mongolia, get the raptors. Okay. So we just won't have any sauropods in this game. I do love me love me some sauropods. But they've put like two of them in the same category. Like whoever designed this, I just wanted to be like, come on guys, we've got uh, Brachiosaurus is in two of the dig sites. Uh, Pachycephalosaurus is in three of the dig sites. Like, how many dinosaurs are there in the world that they, they could just put more in? Alright, so I'm going to open up uh, B. And then I'm going to move my team. I'm going to leave one team in the... Uh, I'm going to leave one team in here because I really need um, uh, an Ankylosaurus. Okay, so it looks like we've got an Albertosaurus. Yeah. The miniature T Rex. There they are. <laughs> Saying that though, I haven't even put in water or food for them. Oh my word. Whoa! What is going on? I've just checked it. Oh no! No! no. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I turn my. Oh no! I turn my back for five seconds and there's all these guests going. <laughs> oh god! Oh no! Oh you bastard! It's too soon for a twister. Too soon. Oh, Jesus Christ, my Albertosaurus are getting out. Oh my God, right. Yep. Now I'm John Hammond, exactly. Oh my God, I've never put this cheat in so quickly in my life. I can gain this back, guys. I know I can. Right, build. Quick. Keep the Albertosaurus in their paddock. God, that happened so quick. Why? Why did there have to be a twister? I just got my T-Rex group open. Right. I got three Alberta sources. They're all in the pen. Uh, any more damage to the park that I should know about? No. Damn. All right. Um, I'm gonna keep going. I'm just gonna keep going to see if uh, I should probably build a bunker if I can. Hmm. 
I'll do the rest area. I don't even know if I can salvage this park. What do you mean lack of security? How the hell do you stop a tornado? You just want like throw a knife into it. <laughs> what do you do when a tornado attacks? I know there's bunkers and stuff, but I haven't even... I don't even think I have a bunker. I don't even think I could research one yet. Where are the bunkers? Yeah, they're down there. I can't, I can't unlock them yet. So what are you meant to do? Yeah, Twister is in the same universe. Ah, oh, he damaged my bloody cleaning station as well. Oh my word. Right. Let's get this all up and running again. Let's get Jurassic Park back online. Without Dennis Nedry. I don't want to read my quarterly report, <laughs> Ludlow. I really don't. I know what it's going to say. Right. I can't believe that. That was so shit. <laughs> it was really crap. Oh, and they're going to charge, aren't they? Right. You know what will bring my stars back up? Is if the park is free. No, no one's going to spend money to lose their life. Right, they repaired. Right, yeah. Nothing else damaged. Are we all good? Okay, are people coming to the park? This is the question. This is the big... Yes! Look at that! All right, we've got people coming back to the park after that horrendous incident with the tornadoes. Okay, we're back on track. Um, right, now I can actually... Uh, let's see if I can... Hello. <laughs> Hello. I'm Robert Muldoon. What the hell are the geneticists doing? <laughs> Good try. All right, so what I'm going to do now is as I'm now getting guests back, hopefully they will, uh, oh, it's that platform, oh, Jesus. Yes, repair it, Jesus. There we go. Right. Hmm. All right, this is going to be the T-Rex kingdom. It's a square of fence here. Oh, and Kylosaurus is so close to being finished. Right, let's go... Um, waiting for my orders. Let's fly the helicopter. By the way, if I keep scratching my hair, it's because I had a haircut the other day and uh, I haven't had short hair in a while, so I'm like getting used to it. It just feels really funny. Um, utility mode. No, shoot mode. Right, 
Now, what I'm going to try and do revive, sedate, cure. Do you know what? I'm going to build a new pen for those, uh, those little buggers. Okay, I can build a rest area now. Build one here, and then I'm going to build another one here on Main Street. What shall I build? Um... Yeah, so this is Main Street. This is my Jurassic World Main Street. So you've got the Mosasaur Lagoon, which I'm working on at the moment. But you've got the Main Street here. Here's Margaritaville. Here's one of the random buildings. And here's uh, where Owen and the kids hide. <laughs> here's, uh, you know, the entrance to the, <laughs> um, what is it, T-Rex Kingdom. That I'll put here the toy store when I get that. But what I need to know, guys, is what should I build over here? Because I think in the film there's like a water park, like slides and stuff, and obviously you can't get those on here. So what should I build? Yeah, Packy's Temple of Sorcerer, okay. Alright. Do they have water in with the Albertosaurus? Or am I just being an absolute idiot and I haven't fed them? I don't think I've got anything for the Albertosaurus at all. Oh my word. I was too distracted by that tornado. Yeah, a little goat. I better dispense it now, actually. There he is. He's going down. Oh my god, look, that Albertosaurus is going straight for him. Oh my word, instantly, look. <laughs> He never even stood a chance. <laughs> it's still barring. Oh no, wait, there's another one. Run, run. <laughs> Ripped his ass cheek off. Ah, the petting zoo, yes. Now, did you know they were actually going to have baby dinosaurs in this game um, just before release? They were going to have uh, baby dinosaurs in the game as well. Okay, T-Rex Kingdom. Now, I really want to make this cool, so instead of having a log, I'm going to have a mountainous bit that goes like that. And build up the mountains a bit more here. In the area where you don't necessarily see. Alright, so T Rex Kingdom. I'll I'll change the fence to the T Rex Kingdom once uh I can once I've researched it. I like to put loads and loads of trees in here because it's meant to live in a conifer forest.
Oh, and Carnosaurus, right, so. Okay. What I'm going to do is. Instead of a petting zoo, I'm going to build the Albertosaurus's paddock right here. Because they're like baby T Rex. Let's just say they're like baby T Rexes. What am I doing? See that we've gone up a half a rating now, so we're on the way up after that hideous tornado incident. Okay. So the storm did no damage. That's good. Right now what I'm gonna do is fly this bad boy. I'm gonna move the uh I'm gonna move the Albertosaurus. Just pause that quickly and see what you guys are saying. Yeah. Yeah, I've got to make sure the Packy Sevensaurus don't get rabies. Uh, two seconds, guys. I'm just going to... I'll be back in a second. Alright, sorry about that guys. What are we doing then? What are we looking at? Let's move this a little bit. Alright. Alright, let's keep playing. Now. So. What I'm going to do is move the Albertosaurus to I'm trying to remember how to move these now. There we go. I like that if you uh, move the camera up high enough, you can see that there's actually nothing holding onto, uh, onto. Well, you got to get it in the right position. Um, uh, you can't really see it, but there's a way of seeing that there's actually nothing holding onto this rope. <laughs> okay, where the hell am I? Oh, I see. Right. Move them into here. Yeah, that here. If you look, <laughs> look, you can just see this. <laughs> there's nothing holding it up. Look. <laughs> All right, he's sedated and in there. Let's go get another one. Well, I had people saying there's a bad flying mechanism on the PS2 version of this, but I've never had a problem with flying this helicopter. Gachi, you son of a bitch. Alright, move it.
say. Birmingham with his brother. What we who we got here? We should make this remake of this game. Cody the Tyrant King has joined us, and ah, uh, oh, Livy's joined us. Hello, Livy, work colleague of mine. Hope you're all good. Uh, all right. Come on, Muldoon, let's do this. Come here. I love that I'm just not reading any of the messages that the park administrator is sending me. I'm moving dinosaurs. Right. Oh, oh no. No. <laughs> didn't, I didn't do it. He's not asleep. Oh, he is. Oh, he is. Oh, good. God, this takes ages. But now I've moved them. Right, now I've moved the Albertosaurus into <laughs> what is the essentially the petting zoo uh, from Jurassic World. I can... Um... Right, I'll let them rest in there. Now I can remove... that, build the vehicles for the gyro, the equivalent of the Gyrosphere Valley. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, there's like a tiny bit of water in the way. Move the water. Alright. Wait, why is there that tiny bit of land? <laughs> or oh, that tiny bit of water? Go on, there we go. Right, now I'm gonna build the lake over here. Is it a river? Yep, that looks good. Build the All right, now you have to drive it, so... There we go, so... This is the equivalent of the gyrospheres from Jurassic World. That's what I'm trying to build here. Um, oh, come on. Cool, right, that's off, off and running. Um, hello, hello, everyone. Do I watch The Gaming Beaver? No, I actually have never heard of The Gaming Beaver. Uh, what else? Am, what am I doing here? Oh, yeah, I'm building a dinosaur, obviously. Um, ah, draft. Got so many messages to read. Okay, Doc, Dr. Sattler is messaging me. That can't be good. That means one of the dinosaurs is ill. Um, oh, there we go. Right, now let's get some Ankylosaurus in here. Oh, right. Come 
Hello, Jay McQuaid, who's just joined the group at the chat. Right, actually, I'll put five Ankylosaurus in there. All right, so we're going to get some Ankylosaurus in here. Um, I'm going to get the path from the Gyrosphere Valley to here. I will make this park look nice and neat in a minute. I'm just sort of sorting out the uh, the old. Look at how messy these paths are. Come on, staff. Where are you? Okay. Alright, so we found some amber from the Cretaceous period. Okay, um, do the uh, dinosaur flu on my word. See, look, she's got the dinosaur flu. The one thing that I didn't research, well, Sorry, Pachycephalosaurus, you're just going to have to suffer with it until it's researched. Hmm. That's about um, 75, 69 pounds or so, a hundred dollars. I mean, this is the game I owned when I was a kid. And I just managed to find when I moved house uh, my old PlayStation 2 sitting in the back and I plugged it all in and it worked. Um, oh, look! T Rex DNA. We've gone up a star as well. Right, so we're back on track after that hideous, hideous uh, tornado incident from earlier. All my dinosaurs are getting flu, so. Right, let's build the path from the. Right, I realise that the park is probably free to enter, so that's why uh, everyone's so happy. I'm going to hire another cleaner. Hire two more cleaners because they're being rather rubbish. Yeah. Oh no, it crashed for you. Alright, let's see our Ankylosaurus, because I just birthed these. There they are, look, marching out in triumph. Now, I'm not going to lie, it's kind of cool that they look like the ones from Jurassic World, don't they? Like with the brown uh, sort of coloration. And then maybe I should feed them. Okay, so uh, Gyrosphere Valley is looking pretty good at the moment. And the Albertosaurus are running around eating goats. Like, 
They're all feasting on this one poor goat. <laughs> okay. Oh no, your sister destroyed your copy of it. That sucks. Let's go to the fossil market and see if we can find some T-Rex. I'm guessing this is T-Rex. No. I'm just going to buy the amber. Alright. Park's looking pretty good. So, it's a little bit, you've got to turn your head on your, on the, you got to turn your head because we're looking at Isla Nublar from <laughs> from the side angle here but yeah so there's, there's the old main street as best I can do it at the moment Gyrosphere Valley is up here oh look look what it is it's the vehicle it's pretty awesome you can actually drive it, actually. So should we uh, give it a, give it a whirl? And I love you get the Lost World type theme when you drive this thing. We're going off road. <laughs> Running into the dinosaurs. take this back. I think they've had enough fun, these people. I forget you can take photos and sell them, can't you? Actually, I'm going to do that. You make some money. Make some holla holla, get the dollar. Right. Oh god, this... Gotta return it back to base. Okay, right. Now what would you recommend in this situation? Message from Dr. Wu. Oh okay, so we can build a Styracosaurus as well for the uh, the old Gyrosphere Valley. There it is. Adding in loads of money because I can't be bothered to keep putting this in. Get a hundred thousand, right? Get five Staracosaurus in there. Right, nice. Now, let's go into research. Now that Dino Rabies is about to be finished. And then I So do you think I should go for umbrellas? Um, I'll go for souvenirs because I need to finish the main street. Gonna save the game quickly because uh, 
should probably save it because I'm not going to like try and complete it tonight, but um, I will uh, come back to this because I'm definitely going to do more live streams. So. <laughs> Palo's watching the stream. Okay, what else we got here? <gasps> here we go, boys and girls. Tyrannosaurus Rex remains have been found. Good tune. What did we do here? Yeah, I know. I've already given him another task. I do believe. And they're doing a souvenir stand. Right. Let's look at some of these happy customers. Who's this? Oh, look, it's the Shining Twins. Come and play with us, Danny. <laughs> Come and play with us forever and ever. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, it's okay. Come and play. Oh, no, they split up. <laughs> oh. oh, look, there's Spielberg. Spielberg slash Trevorrow. There he is, like there's Trevorrow, but we're following Spielberg. Going into the crapper. Oh, he's gone up another half star. Oh, T Rex remains are um almost here. Stuart the Sock has joined the group and said, how late am I? I've been streaming for an hour and 20, one hour and 26 minutes at the moment. And uh, I have no intention of stopping at the moment. Um, still building Jurassic World at the moment. <laughs> yeah, I better get my flare ready. Look at these cleaners, they suck. Maybe I should build some bins. Maybe that will help them. Build some bins in these... Uh, Dirty areas of the park. Now, just so you're aware, guys, um, I'm live streaming Operation Genesis right now, but I'll be live streaming quite often uh, on this channel, and I may even join Twitch and do a few live streams on there. Um, if you guys are ever interested in watching these live streams, uh, I'll be. I'll let everyone know on Twitter when they're about to happen, like I did with this one um, ahead of the time. And you know, I'm I'm planning on live streaming all sorts of games, so I'm going to concentrate on Jurassic Park ones and Alien games uh, for the time being. I might even live stream Grand Theft Auto Five and and all sorts. Um, but it's funny because I don't own a. Uh, no, this is on PlayStation 2. Uh, who is it? Taxemic Fanatic asked. Um, yeah, so I'm planning on live streaming quite a lot. I've got um, Alien Isolation and um, uh, Colonial Marines and the Lego Jurassic World game, and all sorts up there. But, we, but I don't own like a PC. Uh, as in, I don't have like a gaming PC or a latest console. I'm playing this on a PS2 and I've got a PlayStation 3. But the stream should be quite fun anyway, because I'm going to play more older games anyway, because everyone plays new games. So I'll go back and play games like this. Look at this dinosaur that. Then running around in the grass.
Let's see that. Yo, Beckham. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's all money. That's the problem why I can't have a uh, uh, updated console. They're expensive and I'm putting my investments in other things. Is this dinosaur still sick? Right, maybe I should. Maybe I should. <laughs> Hello! Maybe I'll help these dinosaurs, right? Let's go and cure some dinosaurs of their dinosaur flu. Right, that one's cured. Uh, look, there you go, we've got another sick Pachycephalosaurus over here. Gotcha. I don't want to read your quarterly reports. Oh nice, I got 4,000 bonus pounds for that photo of the Ankylosaurus. And, oh, they've got new shipments at the fossil market. Welcome. Um, okay, so let's, let's guess <laughs> what this... Uh, Six thousand dollar five star Cretaceous carnivore could be. Hmm. I bet it's a T Rex. If I'm gonna get that. Buy all the amber because you never know what that is. Don't really want anything else, right? Now I'm going to birth some more uh, Pachycephalosaurus into this one. I'll do three of them because uh, the other ones are getting quite old. Now let's get the, uh, the old carnivore feeder ready. I'm going to put one here, one here. This one's going to dispense cows. This one is going to dispense goats. Now I'm going to add loads and loads and loads of trees in my park because I love trees. Gotta love them trees. Oh wait, I can't. I have no money. Corinthiosaurus DNA, have we got that on here yet? Nope. Okay, um, we need more toilets. So what do you guys who are in the chat what do you guys hope to see in Jurassic World, in the Jurassic World sequel, or should I say Jurassic Park 5? What are you guys excited about? Because for me personally, I'm excited um, at what Colin Trevorrow is saying, that uh, it could be a story about companies, more than one company, more than InGen essentially making dinosaurs. That's what I'm excited about, because it 
has the potential to bring in like biosyn and all that sort of stuff. But what about you guys? What are you excited about? This poor goat <laughs> in the middle of this <laughs> hideousness. All right. She has the research coming along. Ah, they've finished it, right. Uh, umbrellas is a good one. Here we go, look, we can add the souvenir stall now to our main street setup. I'll put the the toy store here, and obviously you've got to have a dress puck toy and amber keychain. I'll put twelve pounds. I'll charge it more. Taxemic fanatic is saying that they should find Dennis Nedry's embryos in the next film. Clonosaurium Productions is saying they're very excited for what they come up with the story. Me too. I mean, I think everyone knows what my opinion is of Jurassic World. I loved it and uh, I can't wait to see where the next film goes. Alright, trees, trees everywhere. Gotta have trees, gotta have trees, gotta have trees. Alright, no more money now. I wasted all my money on trees. Oh, what the hell just happened there? <laughs> I was going so quick. Did I just change it? Okay. I like your thoughts on this. Oh, nice. And close. This is a hundred percent. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna put more food up this end. I feel like the. Excuse me. Dino dog and um, salad. Message from the park administrator. Wow. Well, you don't have to be worried about spoilers for Jurassic World uh, sequel, or JP5, because there is no news for it yet, really. Um, we're ages away from it being released. What do you mean they're not seeing many dinosaurs? Come on. I guess the Pachycephalosaurus are hiding down that end. Let's fix that. Um... Right, Dr. Wu, you hold your horses. Okay. <coughs> you know, I honestly thought that like after that tornado hit the uh, hit the park right at the beginning, that I was gonna lose everything with this match, or well, this match, this uh, this game, this match. 
Where did I get that from? Um, but luckily, I managed to pull it back. <coughs> I'm going to expand the Mosasaur Lagoon now. The Mosasaur Lagoon sands Mosasaur. Pachycephalosaurus has died. Everyone mourn the Pachycephalosaurus. It was... It died of natural causes. Well, that's lovely. Yep, they're all, they're all going to be dying now. natural causes. Alright. Better grow some more, I guess. Yes, Sattler, I know my animals are dead. God, don't you have any <laughs> good news? Um, what am I doing now? Oh yes, Corinthiosaurus. We can have those in the Gyrosphere Valley as well now. In the large herbivore. There they are. Bloody money. Doesn't it ruin your day, money? Just like, in general. <laughs> no, I want it. <laughs> L1 up, L1 down, L1. L1 up, L1 down, L1. Alright. <coughs> Goodness, my throat. L1 up, L1 down, L1. L1 up, L1 down, L1 down. L1 up, L1 down, L1. Oh my god, I can't put this cheat in. What's wrong with me? L1 up, L1 up, L1 down, L1. There we go. L1 up, L1 down, L1. Alright, there we go. Now let's build some more cream for sources. <clears throat> These bad boys. So they're going to be the equivalent of the Parasaurolophus in our Gyrosphere Valley. I think we're getting close to getting the uh, the old T-Rex. Oh, we've got a storm coming in now. Oh, please don't tell me another twister. <laughs> Alright, I just put in the cheat for no twisters. <coughs> Mainly because I don't want to destroy. I don't want to have all this destroyed. We already had one twister. I think that's more than enough for one night. Um, we can have fun with this uh, in a in a bit. Because what I'm going to do is uh, not that I'm going now, but.
but when I decide to leave this stream, uh, I'll save the game and then I'll release the T-Rex and then we can just watch the, uh, the chaos unfold. Network Caitlin says hi, hello, welcome to the uh, live stream. I'm trying to rebuild Jurassic World in Jurassic Park Operation Genesis as best I can. So here we've got Main Street, where you can see there's the toy shop on the left, there's uh, the equivalent of Margaritaville, and there's the uh, Innovation Center. Behind that is the helipad, which is there. Um, we've got the Mosasaur Lagoon here, the um, <laughs> the baby dinosaur arena, which actually just got Albertosaurus in it because I said they were like baby T Rexes. Uh, the Pachycephalosaurus arena, it's got many Pachycephalosaurus in it, including many dead ones. <laughs> and then this will be the T Rex kingdom when it's finished, next to the uh, next to Main Street. And up here you have the equivalent of the Gyrosphere Valley, which has the Ankylosaurus, Styracosaurus instead of Triceratops, and Gringfiosauruses, which are my newest dinosaurs. And instead of Gyrospheres, we've got the Land Cruisers. So far. When I go up a star, I can, I can get Raptors. Actually saying that, let's see if we can get them now. So I want the Flaming Cliff Site A. Ah, <clears throat> oh, I've got to get another star, haven't I? Right. It's got rabies. Oh, come on. I thought I'd research that. See if I can uh, help this dinosaur. Is that passed out then? Maybe I need to revive it actually. They should all be destroyed. I can't believe this is happening. What should we do? Yeah, I've really done it. <clears throat> oh, a nice shipment of dinosaurs. Dinosaur skeletons. Oh, there we go, five star, yeah. I want that T-Rex, I want that T-Rex. <coughs> My word. <coughs> I'm just gonna go get a uh, glass of water quickly. <sighs>
All right, guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. I had to get a glass of water. Oop. But I actually ended up getting a uh, ginger beer, and I've got it in the this Jurassic Park mug right here with this like raptor bursting onto Ellie. This old McDonald's cup. Um, I've actually got the whole set of this thanks to um, Jurassic Collectibles, who was kind enough to uh, send uh, send the collection over to me. So for you, old JC. Right now, we are getting close to having a T Rex, guys. Just want you to know. So let me. Uh, Get the old birthing thing ready. <clears throat> How can I help? <gasps> All right, we can have a T-Rex, guys. The time has come. <laughs> well, I don't know if he uh, he might be disgusted I'm drinking out of him, but uh -huh. I'm thirsty. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna have a T-Rex. Any minute. All right, we've got to listen to this. You can hear the animal. <laughs> I love that you can hear them inside there. You hear the cows going, <coughs> and then you just hear a little sound that goes, <coughs> like that, <laughs> and they're dead. All right. Here it comes. Open paddock nine. Oh no. <sighs> yeah, baby. Got a motherfucking T Rex. That is what we're talking about. Look at it. Looking pretty awesome, I have to say. Come on, do a roar. Yeah. Yeah, and it eats a goat straight away. <laughs> See right down his throat. Come on, do the roar. Do the roar. Yeah. All right. So now I've got the T Rex, and now I can demolish this. Uh, I'll just build another one if I need one. Um, I should be able to now. Yep. Get the the lure that dispenses uh, carnivore smell, and then people can see that. All right. I've got loads of messages. What is this? My ankylosaurus has died of natural causes. Okay, better build enough one then. Build three more because I know they're going to start dropping like flies in a minute. Hmm. I think it would be wise a visit a shelter, yes. Okie dokie. Now, um, when I go up another half star, I can get the uh, the raptors and start researching for those. The old T Rex coming to put on a show look for the people in the visit in the uh, viewing dome. Let's see what they see. Okay. Yeah, look at that! Look instantly. There's your bucks, people. That's what you're paying to come and see. The T Rex. Yeah, look at that.
And what I like about this game is you could get the uh, the Spinosaurus as well and actually have them fight. Um, and the results would always be you could never know, you never know which one was gonna win, which was what I liked. What's this person saying? The violent ex <laughs> the violent enclosures are great. That's what she's saying. That like she's even bought a little tiny T Rex toy. That's a Jurassic Park fan right there. Right, who have we got here? The greatest holiday I've ever had. <laughs> I thought they were in the toilet saying that for a second then. Okay, so Park's looking pretty good. Oh, for God's sake, Ellie sat there. Animals die. Get over it. Alright. Now I feel like I'm going to start to build the raptor enclosure, ready for them. Um, I'm going to build it like Owen Grady's little shack. Um, and he had it on the coast, didn't he? So let's build. in that cheat so quickly there. All right. Actually, let me do this again. building system on this game is really good as well. It's quite simple. But I wish they, I think if they ever did a sequel, they'd make it a little bit more complicated. Um, as in like what you can get in the game. guys saying in the chat. Have a look here. The insanely intelligent feathered Velociraptor says, I'm going to watch The Lost World. Enjoy. The Lost World is uh, one of the best movies ever made. Hi. What I know is, can you build two entrances to this? Hmm. Maybe. Let's check out how the research goes. Hey. So this will be the equivalent of that long path they have in Jurassic World where the raptors chase the uh, the medivan. And then they appear just next to the visitor centre, don't they? Or the innovation centre. So if I build this path like there, then this will be ready for when they, when the velociraptors turn up. People can go to them. So you have to use your imagination with this park. It's like like Jurassic World, but. Um, <laughs> it's limited to what Operation Genesis allows me to build. <coughs> oh, 
Oh, I keep coughing. Save the game. Right. It's funny how long games take to save on a memory card that has eight megabytes of uh, <laughs> space for games to be saved on. Like that took ages. Okay. Now there were some people in this game that looked like the characters from Jurassic Park. So I think this is the guy who looks a little bit like Ian Malcolm, is it? Yeah, like a tiny, tiny little bit like Ian Malcolm. Look at this hideousness. Look at the cleaner! Oi, give me some burgers. I'm working all day in the sun. I want some burgers. Give me a nice, cool, refreshing beverage. It would be cool if you could get a um, Indominus Rex on this, I think. And actually, like, have a hybrid in the park. Okay. Um, hmm. How's the research teams coming along? <coughs> Okay, we're about to get that. I think we've just gone up a star. Yeah, so now we can now we can get the the V Raptors, your Velociraptors, Pack Hunters. They should all be destroyed. <laughs> yeah, charge seven bucks for soda. Do you hear yourself when you talk? <laughs> Okay, let's get some raptors on the go. Oh no. God damn it. Didn't need to press that button. I know, right? Sicktrike just said there's, there's so much stuff they can include. Um, yeah, there's, there's just so much potential with this. Like, this came out in 2003, and this game actually, you know, for what it is, it actually has a lot of stuff going on. I mean, I'm barely tapping the surface here, like, what with the missions, the campaign side of it, and, um, you know, the the whole site B uh, part of this game as well, which I'll have to do in a live stream just for a laugh. Uh, what am I doing? Security. Okay, now people will feel safe. Build one there, and then I'll build one. Uh, the, on the edge of the uh, Mosasaur Lagoon, if I can. Mm. Actually, I'll only build it up here. 
Well, actually, it'd look quite good up here, wouldn't it? Because it would look kind of like uh, part of the old Raptor Arena. There wasn't that tiny, tiny, tiny bit of water in the way. Just gonna get rid of all this. And then. Uh, there we go. Right. I'm gonna start to try and reshape this island. This is going to take some skill, in a way. Um, right. I'm going to try and get this to look like Isla Nublar, essentially. So I'm going to need to chip off a tiny bit there, I guess. Yeah, see, that would be cool. Like the whole, what uh, Sick Triker said here is they could have a more involved uh, genetic engineering system that says, that has, say, a 1% chance causing a result of a dinosaur becoming an unsuccessful hybrid and becoming a abomination. Exactly. Who wouldn't want that? Right. Now what we're doing is there's this big square bit. Can you look after this while I get a soda? Hey! Hey! Alright, let's check these messages. Yep. Yep. <laughs> oh dear, what was that? Yeah, what was that? Wow, <laughs> um, this glass just exploded in my kitchen, um, don't really know why, um, what I'll do is I'm going to actually keep playing for a little bit, but my god, it's like this glass sheet just exploded in the kitchen, I have no idea why. The Albertosaurus are dead. <laughs> guys what I'm gonna do is because the glass just exploded in my uh, kitchen is I'm going to uh, save the game I'm gonna end the stream here because uh, I have been streaming for two hours ten minutes now and then uh, I'm gonna uh, yeah I'll come back and play this another night and do another stream and that just means I have an excuse to come back and do it um, yeah I'll take a picture of what happened in the kitchen uh, and show you, but <laughs> it's strange. I don't know what happened. Uh, I think there was like maybe a temperature change, but it does mean I have to go clean up a load of glass now. So, But anyway, on that note, I hope you've enjoyed the stream. Um, 
I will be playing this more in the future. I will be doing a lot more live streams. Uh, got loads of stuff I want to play. So, yeah, I hope to see you then. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoy. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.